Uh, yeah. Um, yeah. Ow. <laughs> Man. But... Oh, oh, oh. Nice dodging. I don't know how I did that, but... I'll, I'll take it. Yeah, you know, it's uh, it's crazy. Is the I think the only other game that I personally am really, really excited for is, uh, I told you, the remaster of Shinmu 1 and 2. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm well, on to this retro it's, gaming. It's not really a... Not, damn it. Yeah, it's just a... a HD upgrade. Yeah, HD yeah. upgrade. And I've, I've read that they've kind of been backing off of calling it HD upgrade, too. So I'm kind of wondering what it is. Um, Dude, if it's still Dreamcast graphics, I will still play the game. <laughs> no, it's I, it's it. Uh, from what I understand, it's more of a re-release than a remaster. Yeah. But I'm still like, yeah, like I'm. Ex Dude, I'd be a little upset actually if if they did like a little polishing on graphics. I'd be like, okay, but the horrible dialogue. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, can you tell me where I can find some sailors? <laughs> like ah, oh, no, dicks. Yeah, like. You know, I want that. I want that to be in there. Because as a kid, that game, like, intrigued me. Right. Oh, wow. I, you know, I blame Shinmu for a lot of shit. I've given Shinmu a lot of shit over the years for some of the... Oh. For some of the stuff it did. I should have switched to Pharaoh. And, but, um... I, it, it doesn't deserve the shit that I've given it, honestly. Um, because Shinmu kind of, for a while there, in the early 2000s, yeah, 2000s. Um, <laughs> every single fucking game that came out had to incorporate uh, quick time events. Oh, uh, yeah, no. Yeah, and yeah. I wholeheartedly blame Shinmu for that, because... While there were games that came out that kind of had those mechanics, yeah, Shinmu is definitely the first one that I can think of that really, really d drove that home. Get up here, you! Okay, um, really drove that shit home. Like it. Ah, no, 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 no! Fuck. <laughs> Anyway, Shinmu. Yeah, it did. No, um, I, I, I agree with that. And it it did it well. Um, oh, oh nice. you know, you know what game I think took the ball and ran with it though even more to worse. Remember the thing. Yeah. There you go. That's what I was gonna say. Yeah. Try to drop more to the middle. Uh, is there another? Oh, this asshole. Oh. Uh, um, God of War. Yeah. God and of War. The original God, first three God of Wars were so. Quick time event. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, that's why. Fucking asshole. Well, that's why I've heard the new one's so good is because they've changed all the dynamic of the game. Right. Oh. How did I die from a stationary enemy? You're in its hitbox. Dude, you're talking about getting a bunch of lives. Just keeps throwing them at me. Which I'm cool with. Like. Yeah. Um. Oddly, I'm. I don't want to say I'm enjoying this, but it's. It's getting to the point with Mega Man, like, oh. like, like you said, where I'm kind of. Ah. Uh, now that's some bullshit. Um, oh, that enemy's coming back. I'm not going that way again. <laughs> I much prefer the high road. You're on it right now. Well, now, but I, I took the low road for a bit. Fuck off. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, my God. You too. Come here, fucker. All right.
Ooh, yep, that's it. Let's see, now let's see if I can hit this fucking asshole. Nope. Huh. You know, I wonder. Fuck you, Rush! <laughs> Dang! What did Rush do to you? He just went through the fucking level. Nice. I'm probably still gonna die. Nice. How many? Oh god. Hey, uh, if you want to use an energy tank, try it. Yeah. You got Pharaoh shot. This is one shot, and you don't even have full Pharaoh shot. Yeah. Uh, let's just get through this. A fucking eight ring, man. Yeah, because it's got to charge up. Any day now. Fucking... You know what? What happened? I'm using another E-Tank. Yeah, I saw that. Sorry, but... Are you out of Pharaoh? No, it just switched me back. to two E tanks on that too. Yeah, I was, uh... So, um, just for your reference though, Pharaoh Shot is kind of weird. Um, so it doesn't necessarily shoot when you think it's going to. Um, and if you're not using it a lot, it 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 does get awkward. So, um, oh, I'm just warning you, my. Well, we will see how I fare when I get there. I haven't yet to get there. So, I think I'm going to do it this time. What? Okay. Then I was playing Marvel vs. Capcom with the <laughs> Berserker Barrage. Get out of the way. Oh, but, wow. That was almost really bad. <laughs> in, uh, in Sonic news... Um, Ooh. if, if you're watching this and don't know, they're, they're making a Sonic the Hedgehog I'm movie. green. Oh. <laughs> they're making a Sonic the Hedgehog movie. Um, it's going to be a live action, um, CGI mix. Um, the story, or the synopsis, sounds fucking abysmal uh it's something like a small quiet midwestern town tries to protect sonic from an evil doctor um we gotta I, save sonic y'all yeah or an evil doctor in the fbi or something some <laughs> anyway um nice yeah i don't even i don't even know um but oh wow in in addition to how utter that was worth it um, how utterly wonderful the movie sounds so far. Um, there's an interesting rumor for the cast. So, um, I, I think they got the same voice actor that does Sonic and Sonic Boom to do the voice of Sonic in the movie. Because, I mean, of course, um, that guy voices Sonic in the Sonic Boom cartoon. He'll do anything for money. Um. Yep. <laughs> Yep, I totally uh, activated it. But the uh, the cast of Robotnik is, I, I think, the most interesting. Oh, yeah, Cause, wait, yeah. Yeah, because it's not any single actor that you would normally think of when you think Robotnik. Like, yeah. Um, or I, I, I'm saying Robotnik because I think that's actually what they're planning on calling him in the movie. Yeah. Um, which is a change of pace. Yeah, well, well, I mean, it's written by, written and directed by an American, so I would. Yeah. Um, and I think he's maybe seen a Sonic game, um, maybe. So yeah. So there's, there's a chance that. 
It could be He's, done right. Well, no, I I think it's going to be god awful. I think I think this movie is going to be spectacularly awful on the same level as the Super Mario Brothers movie. Wow. Um, if it's just mediocre, I'm going to be disappointed. I am not <laughs> expecting it to be good at all. Um, just nice. based on the previous work of the director, um, he's done a short. Um, that's it. Um, previous work of the writer, I think maybe he might have walked past the GameStop once. Um, <laughs> so, but it may be gloriously good bad good gloriously bad good just because of the casting of robotnik because as as of us recording this video right now the current um like most likely actor he hasn't accepted but he's auditioned and you know going through the process is jim carrey now it's been it's been years since jim carrey's been like big but if there is any actor that I would never think of yeah. to play Robotnik, it would be, it Jim, would be Carrey. Jim Carrey. So, yeah, I would agree with that. Um, nice. I'm, but I mean, like that's that's horribly mm. bad on the same level as Dennis Hopper playing Koopa, like King yeah. Koopa. So, um. Like an actor that's way too good in this movie. Yeah. Um. So. I'm. So far. <laughs> so far. Everything for this movie looks like it's going to be a train wreck of the most glorious proportions. And you're just standing there watching. Oh yeah. Um. As huge of a Sonic fan as I am, I enjoy the train wrecks just as much as I enjoy the good games. Well, I don't want to say just as much. I enjoy the good games more. I enjoy the yeah. train wreck train wrecks in a different way. Yeah, that makes um, sense. Mainly part of the shitstorms that they create. Like, because I'm expecting the movie to be bad. Yeah. Um I know there's a lot of people a lot of Sonic Hey, extra life. A lot of Sonic fans out there that are that are hoping it'll be good. Um, and so when it's bad, they're going to be like, <laughs> you know. Yeah. Um, Why well, you're going to be like, I knew it was going to be bad. Yeah. And then there's going to be a lot of fans that are going to be like, it's not bad. And, you know, they're the same fans that say Shadow the Hedgehog isn't bad. Um, they're the ones that take up for Sonic 06. I mean, they exist. And Oh. Um, I beat both of those with X-Buster. I'm crazy. Yeah. Meg Megabuster. I mean, yeah. Megabuster. Well, that's still the first one, actually. Never mind. Yeah. Um, no, the... Um, oh. The, there's those fans out there that will defend it no matter how bad it is. Um, you know, they're, they're in every genre. Every game yeah. has those fans. Yeah. Um, Sonic is or a kind of special, um, and I, I I don't mean that in like special. I mean like special. They're, they're unique to Sonic fandom. Oh. Don't don't get me wrong. I'm not calling anyone like mentally challenged. Although if you do like Sonic 06, maybe. Um, <laughs> I've never played it. I I I've heard plenty about it. I rented it for Xbox, and I got through two loading screens and then gave up. Um, Sounds like a, a winner. Yeah. All right, so... You, yeah, I was about to no, say. No, I'm going to change it. Yeah. I plan on using it more on the second one, because you really only have enough for one. Right. Based on energy anyways. So... But and now it's being nice. No matter how the movie turns out, it's it's going to be glorious just to see people's reactions. Yeah. Um, Agreed. Agreed. And, and yeah. you know, don't don't get me wrong. I'm not the kind of person that's like, oh, well, Sonic's was never good. Oh, fuck you too, Eddie. <laughs> um, nice. Actually, I needed that. Well, yeah, but 
it'd have been nice to get like an e-tank 